Hi everyone, today we're going to draw Foxy Colleen. Let's grab our markers and let's begin. We're going to start off by drawing Colleen's nose. So we can stand here in the middle of the page. We're going to draw a little nose with a light reflection. And we're going to fill in her nose. Now a little bit off to the side, I'm going to draw a curve up and then right on top of the nose, I'm just going to draw a curve back to her nose. Now on this side, I'm going to draw an eye, a pupil and then we're going to complete the eye. We go to the side. We're going to draw the eye, and I'll make a, a shorter curve. I'm going to come into the side. I'm going to draw a pupil. I'm just going to draw the eye again. Right. So now we're going to go, and we're going to fill the pupils in. We're going to go down and we're going to draw Colleen's mouth. We're going to go underneath, we're going to draw a chin and just a light curve. I'm going to go to this side and we're just going to draw some whiskers and on this side as well. Just above her eye, we're going to draw a forehead and then on the sides going to draw some eyelashes. There we go. I'm going to go a bit higher and I'm going to draw some hair and connect it to the forehead. I'm going to jump to the other side and I'm going to draw some hair there as well. Now I'm going to step a little bit down and we're going to start and we're going to draw some hair going down there. I'm going to go up connect it and I'll go up again and I'll connect some hair there as well. I'm going to go up. I'll just draw some hair for her ear and I'll just do two lines going down from there. Next up I'm going to do her ears. I'm going to do the inside of her ear right there and I'll do the outside as well. Now from a whisker, I'm going to curl her hair down and I'm going to bring it back. Then on this side, I'll do the inside here and then the outside as well. Now we're going to jump to the top. We're going to start drawing her head above. Then on the side, we're going to curl her hair as well there. Next thing we're going to do, we're going to go down to her neck. So we're going to draw a neck and shoulders. I'm going to make a downwards curve for her shirt. And then I'm going to draw a torso. I'm going to start right in the middle and on this side as well. And then for her body. So her waist and her hips. I'm going to make this line shorter than the other one. Then I'm going to go downwards curve, connect the two lines. Now before we go back, I just want to finish the first part of a dress. Curve a line out, bring it in. And then I'm just going to make random shapes like material flowing of a dress and of the 
this one and just bring it over like this. And then a dividing line for the waist. We're going to continue with the shoulder and it's going to go down to her arm and then the sleeves of a dress. I'm going to go on this side, I'm going to do the same. Bring a line down and then of course you're just going to draw the sleeves there as well. And now we can finish with her hair. So we're going to start and I'll just draw her hair there, here as well, and then on this side. We can do this as well and maybe just some hair there. Then continuing down, we're going to finish the dress. Curve out and on the other side I'll make a longer curve. Maybe I'll extend this a little and then I'm just going to make a curvy line to connect everything. I'm going to go down and I'm going to do the same as I did here. well curve up and then another curve here we're going to go to the back and we're going to draw Colleen's tag so I'm just going to start here I'm going to curve I'm going to draw a big bushy tail bring it back and then of course we're just going to divide everything there as well and maybe bring the line back there as well and there we go in this Colleen. Now check my picture out and try to match the colors. Thank you for drawing with me. Please don't forget to click the like button and subscribe to my channel. And I will see you soon. Bye bye.